Hello everybody, let's see who we're reading for next. We're reading for, that's the wrong rock in the wrong pile. <laughs> oh, I picked two. What to do, what to do. We're reading for Leo's next, my friends. Let's see what's going on for Leo's. For all those who have liked, shared, and subscribed, thank you so much for your support. For those who have hit me up for personal readings, <clears throat> you rock. Thank you. And to all of those who have donated, I appreciate it more than I can say. The channel is much better off because you do. The channel. Well, that could be me, I suppose. We all are because it allows me to do what I need to do. To help and benefit you guys. <clears throat> all right. To all those who are new, welcome. And thank you for finding us. We've been waiting for your presence. If anything resonates, please leave a comment below. I do get back to everybody. <clears throat> That frog in my throat. I'm guessing my Leos maybe need to speak a truth or they did recently. Energy is feeling a little stuck where love is concerned. I'm not sure how to balance out the now to make everybody happy in the future or the present. All right, my Leo friends, see what we got going on. This is a snapshot for you guys for June. Whenever it resonates, it resonates. All right, let's see what we go going on. If it doesn't resonate the beginning of June, it might resonate the middle. If it doesn't resonate the middle, it might resonate at the end. If it doesn't resonate at all, it doesn't resonate at all. That's the way it goes sometimes. What do we got? We got the four of earth. Being too frivolous or too cautious with money. Good business decisions giving to those less fortunate. So you guys are holding on to something incredibly tightly. Let's remember not to strangulate it. And we have a water sign. Relationships develop to a new level. Trust your intuition, care for yourself and others. If not a water sign, it's just your energy. <clears throat> or someone's energy around you is very caring, tentative, nurturing, loving. Maybe you're developing more of your water in your chart if you have some in there. Could be dealing with Virgo Taurus Capricorn. And it has to do with stable home environment. Something with the home environment where an earth sign is concerned. Dealing with a Virgo, or are you going into hermit mode? You're concerned maybe about nefarious nonsense from an earth sign. Maybe you feel like people are just asking too much from you, Leo friends. And you can't help everybody all the time. You've got a home to think about. You have a wife to think about. You have a hubby to think about. You have your own crap going on. Probably have a dog and a cat and a hamster too. <laughs> Passionate messages coming in from someone who's in and out of your life possibly. Maybe it could even be an ex-spouse. These messages are going to bring victory in some way, shape, or form, but I think someone else thinks there's nefarious nonsense going on. Ah, it's going to bring equal reciprocity. So, you've been trying to get out, well, the getting's good. If it's not about lying, cheating, stealing, it, it, you're trying to get out while the getting's good. Because you fear something's about to unfold in your happy, home, stable environment. Could be also dealing with an Aquarius. Put him on the side. You want equal reciprocity with that Aquarius, and you've had a broken heart because there's been none. Maybe it took a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn to bring that to your attention. Although, being a Leo, I can't imagine you would need anyone to bring that to your attention. The very happy outcome coming your way, even though there's been heartache and disappointment, feel like you've been stabbed in the heart with hope, faith, and trust. All those swords of truth and knowledge we use on a daily basis. Well, I got this one, which flipped. This, a love offer. Going to this person's energy. 
And then I have the Wheel of Fortune. And I have Take a Rest. Someone's been grieving or feeling like they're doing it all themselves. But there's a lot of love here. And there's a big old heart that needs to be filled. And it's something you've waited a long time for. Coming from this person, my Leo friends. It could be an earth sign. Relationships develop to a new level. Trust your intuition. Care for yourself and others. We have balance we need to find balance in the situation or someone doing too much juggling whether it's with work whether it's with home friends family maybe you don't have enough arms and legs because you're not an octopus <laughs> temporary pause in action you're taking a brief moment to see that which you've created but there's unnecessary worry because you feel like something's ending you feel like the divine stepping in maybe to end something. You feel like someone's going to walk away. Tired of dealing with the BS maybe. Maybe someone thinks they're turning their back to celebrating because they're concerned about what's happened. But we got the Ten of Pentacles here, my friend. That, however, could be an ending to that financial as well but i don't see it on this side i usually go the side and then the side and then combined so if there's a celebration because beautiful financial blessings are coming and you just have to wait a little bit and then you're going to have a period of time where you got to buckle down and really get the work done my leo friends perhaps someone spoke a truth and it made somebody feel stabbed in the back over it and out in the cold and there's that no bs puller right there you could be your guys's energy yeah made someone make a decision you didn't think you were at a crossroads well guess what you're at a crossroads <laughs> yeah there's things behind the scenes that you're possibly not aware of that you need to be aware of things that being that it's gemini full moon today i believe at some point you're dealing with a soulmate. Yeah, perhaps there's things you'll be made aware of right now during this new moon. Not full moon, sorry. New moon. If I said full moon, I apologize. Yeah, someone wants to walk away from emotional turmoil into something more you know, stable into their nine of cups. Give me the best advice for my Leos, please. It looks to me like they're walking right towards... Your soulmate however maybe something ended there was a brief ending and they realized i don't want to be without you let's cut out the bs let's be together let's make the decision to do the work to be with each other and walk away from emotional crap you are protected from all types of harm the worst is now behind you i ask you to relax and feel safe Give me two cards please on what's connecting these two issues give me the central the ties that are connecting this whole situation here. We have the two of wands again. Coming into your own near partnerships or contracts. Continue to move forward. Well, it says to continue to move forward. And someone's moving forward right to their soulmate. My Leo friends. Oh my goodness. I don't need five cards. Okay, let's just do one card, please. I'll stop talking. We got the Three of Swords. Great sadness. Time to, to heal the need to forgive yourself and others. <clears throat> Look at that. And then we have the Sun coming out. And the Six of Fire. And the King of Air. That's, that's this guy over here. And Balance. So regardless of what you've been through with this heart, heart pain and the whatever, the Divine's here in the background. It's got you in a protective bubble. Things are going to work out. You're going to have victory with this situation. Yeah, we got Queen of Swords. We got Soulmate Energy here. Yes, we do. She's coming through real strong as Queen of Swords. She is done putting up with crap. Seven of Cups, not sure which way to head in. We have a light worker here, my friend. Somebody who's got the knowledge of the divine. Perhaps they don't know it yet. to do with the lovers this is definitely deep soulmate connection right here between these two people that is for sure yeah and then we have the world so 
The world is end of a situation or a phase in your life and start of a new one. Perhaps you're going to go into light working yourself. And I got the Ten of Wands putting the burden down. <clears throat> you guys will have to message me and let me know what you're putting the burden down towards. All right, we'll talk to you later. Blessings.